creating a macro to insert a file path in the footer. First of all, you need to save your file. Once your file is saved, then you need the Developer tab in your ribbon. If you can't see the Developer tab in your ribbon, click File, Options, Custom Ribbon, and place a tick next to the Developer. Clicking on the Developer tab, there's a Record Macro button. You need to name your macro with camel formatting and no spacing. You can add a button if you wish. This means that the button will appear in your screen up the top uh, above your uh, toolbar. We're going to uh, create a button. And we're going to apply it to all normal documents that open. We can push Add. And then we can modify so then it has a uh, button. So we're going to choose a button in here. Something that relates to the footer. So I'm going to choose this one here. So the black is indicating that uh, this is regarding the footer. Then once you press OK, then the recording is going to begin. Your mouse turns as a cassette tape. Then you just do all the steps that it takes to insert a footer. So double click in the footer space. Then click on Insert Quick Parts Field File Name. Place a tick in Add a File to Path and OK. What the macro doesn't do is actually change the font size, so you would have to do this later. Once you're finished recording, then go back to Developer and stop recording. You'll see that uh, the icon has been placed in your uh, ribbon. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to erase the footer to demonstrate the um, macro performing so it, it places it in there you don't have to double click at all so just one more time as a demonstration so I'm not in the footer at all and then clicking on my icon and it places the file path into the footer and that's how you record the macro to place a file path in the footer thank you for watching